Hi, I'm Dr. Dave. The Latissimus dorsi, plural, Latissimi dorsi, is the larger, flat, dorsolateral muscle on the trunk, posterior to the arm, and partly covered by the trapezius on its median dorsal region. The Latissimus dorsi is responsible for extension, adduction, transverse extension also known as horizontal abduction, flexion from an extended position, and internal rotation of the shoulder joint. It also has a synergistic role in extension and lateral flexion of the lumbar spine. The number of dorsal vertebrae to which it is attached vary from 4 to 8. The number of costal attachments varies. Muscle fibers may or may not reach the crest of the ilium. A muscular slip, the axillary arch, varying from 7 to 10 centimeters in length, and from 5 to 15 millimeters in breadth, occasionally springs from the upper edge of the latissimus dorsi about the middle of the posterior fold of the axilla, and crosses the axilla in front of the axillary vessels and nerves, to join the undersurface of the tendon of the pectoralis major, the coracobrachialis, or the fascia over the biceps brachii. This axillary arch crosses the axillary artery, just above the spot usually selected for the application of a ligature, and may mislead a surgeon. It is present in about 7% of subjects and may be easily recognized by the transverse direction of its fibers. A fibrous slip usually passes from the upper border of the tendon of the latissimus dorsi, near its insertion, to the long head of the triceps brachii. This is occasionally muscular, and is the representative of the dorsopedrotularis brachii of apes. The latissimus dorsi is supplied by the 6th, 7th, and 8th cervical nerves through the foracodorsal, long scapular, long subscapular, nerve. Thanks for listening. Goodbye.